ساز قطقه با این ساز قطقه دختر بیا پای بزن با این ساز قطقه با این ساز قطقه میده میده پای بزن خراب تنبی نو اندالت نازل بدن Welcome to my kitchen. On today's recipe, I have uh, one of the uh, very popular Afghan snack, and this is known for the name of uh, Afghan pakara. Pakara is made from uh, potatoes and some spices, and you can serve this with your favorite uh, dip. I'm going to be showing you how to make chutney today, the Afghan creamy uh, chutney. Uh, that is pickles basically. So let's go to the ingredients. Let's take a look at the recipe. For the pakora, we need uh, potatoes. So I have about three medium potatoes here soaked in the water and I have sliced them as thin as I could. Make sure you are soaking in the water, especially if you're getting prepared or else the color of this will turn into a darker. We also got to make a batter of it. So I'm using um, chickpea flour here. Um, this is um, this gives really good flavor. If you don't like to use chickpea flour, this is ground chickpea flour. You can use your regular all-purpose flour, white flour. You just have to add the turmeric powder in it. And for the chutney, I'm using uh, cilantro here, fresh coriander cilantro, some uh, green uh, chili pepper. Uh, also, I need some uh, <clears throat> garlic. Garlic can be divided between the batter of the pakora and for the chutney. And I also need some um, yogurt to make it creamy, white vinegar, I also have some spices here, uh, turmeric, salt and garam masala is the mixed spice. This is optional if you have your own spice you can use that as well. And uh, some water. So let's go to the cooking. I'm going to start with making the chutney. So I'm going to put everything I have here in my mixer to blend this. I'm also going to have the green uh, chili pepper and two uh, garlic cloves. If you don't like spicy, you can reduce the green chili pepper. I'm also going to need some vinegar, so I'm using less than a half a cup of vinegar here. Half a teaspoon of salt, salt is to your chest. Once you blend everything, it should look something like this. Once you have it in a bowl, you're going to add about two tablespoons of uh, yogurt on this. Once you mix everything well, it should look something like this and your chutney is ready. If it's too spicy, you can add more yogurt and it's time to make the batter. So I have my uh, half cup here. So I'm going to use uh, the chickpea flour, half a cup times two. I'm also going to use one clove of garlic here, crushed garlic. I'm also going to use uh, one tablespoon of my chutney for flavor. Half a teaspoon of salt, salt is to your taste. Uh, half a teaspoon of um, garam masala and a, a one teaspoon of um, turmeric powder. I'm going to use half a cup of water here. I'm using my second half a cup of water here. The batter is ready for the pakora, potato pakora, so you don't want to have it too thick or too runny, so this is just good enough. I use just a little bit over one cup of water. I have uh, my pan here on medium heat, some generous amount of oil you need. Make sure this is hot enough before you fry the potato pakora. So we're going to go ahead dip the potatoes here and fry them one by one. You're gonna flip them like every 20 seconds, just to make sure. And let this get uh, fried until it's nice golden brown. It took me about three minutes to uh, fry these, so now they're ready to be out. The uh, Afghan uh, potato pakora is ready with the creamy green chutney. I hope you guys get a chance to try this um, dish or snack and thank you very much for watching today's show. Please do subscribe.